Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. It is hard hitting with a powerful message. This is a PSA that local leaders just released in hopes of saving lives. Most areas will see lots of sunshine. She's not breathing. It's my daughter. She's 17. Help her! 911 to ambulance. 17 year old female is on She got that pill on social media. Oh God, she's leaving for college next week. Fentanyl <laughs> is death in disguise. One pill can kill. And you can't rewind. A message from the United States Attorney's Office, the Drug Enforcement Administration, and the District Attorney's Offices of San Bernardino and Riverside Counties. And you heard it there. It is dramatic. And law, law enforcement leaders, they say they wanted to get the public's attention. And this is a collaborative public outreach education campaign with a number of agencies involved to address this ongoing fentanyl epidemic in the Inland Empire. And it's called Death in Disguise to highlight the dangers of fentanyl use. Now, according to the DEA, six out of 10 pills tested, counterfeit pills sold online and also on the streets contain potentially lethal doses of the powerful opioid fentanyl. Last year in the Inland Empire, authorities had confirmed that they filed seven cases alleging distribution of fentanyl that resulted in deaths. And they say many fake pharmaceutical pills are on the black market and they're contributing to the rise in fatalities. Because of the deception involved in the distribution of fentanyl, specifically fake pills and cocaine mixed with or mistaken for fentanyl, providing education and building awareness is the number one thing we can do to immediately reduce the threat to the public. It is our hope that when we help create a PSA or speak to a group of teenagers at a school, we are empowering people with knowledge about fentanyl, what it is, what it does to the body, and where it is in the illicit drug supply chain so they can make better decisions about their personal drug use. And it's not just releasing PSAs. Authorities say they're spending a lot of time at schools actually going inside the classrooms to speak with students on the dangers of using drugs. That's the latest in Riverside. Kareen Winter, KTLA 5 News. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.